welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss a question which says that equations of two regression lines are 5x plus 8y is equal to 70 and 8x plus 5y is equal to 50. Find first part regression coefficients byx and bxy. Second part correlation coefficient between x and y. Now before starting the solution of this question, we should know some results. First is, for the regression equation, of y on x, that is, y is equal to mx plus c, the coefficient of x, is called the regression coefficient of y on x that is given by by x that is coefficient of x is m so here the regression coefficient of y on x is m which is denoted by by x also the slope of this line is called the regression coefficient of y on x. Secondly, for the regression equation of x on y, that is, x is equal to my plus c, the coefficient of y is called the regression coefficient of x on y that is bxy. Now here, the regression coefficient of x and y is m, which is the coefficient of y. And third is, r square is equal to byx into bxy. Where r is the correlation coefficient And minus 1 is less than or equal to r is less than or equal to 1. That is, value of r varies from minus 1 to 1. Now, these results will work out as a key idea for solving out this question. And now, we will start with the solution. Now, the two regression lines are given to us. So given the two regression lines that are 5x plus 8y is equal to 70 and 8x plus 5y is equal to 50. Let this be equation number 1 and this be equation number 2. Now let equation number 1 be the regression line of x on y. Then the equation 2 is the regression line of y on x. Now we will check that whether our assumption is correct or not. Now we have assumed that the equation 1 is the regression line of x on y. Now from then we have Five x is equal to minus eight y plus seventy, which implies x is equal to minus eight by five y plus seventy by five. Now, using this result, which is given in the key idea, the regression coefficient of x and y 
will be dxy and this is equal to coefficient of y which is equal to minus 8 by 5. Now we have assumed this equation as the regression line of y and x. Now from 2 we get 5y is equal to minus 8x plus 50 which further implies y is equal to minus 8 by 5x plus 50 by 5. Now using this result which is given in the key idea, the coefficient of regression of y on x that is dyx is equal to the coefficient of x in this equation which is minus 8 by 5. Therefore, dxy is equal to minus 8 by 5 and dyx is also minus 8 by 5. Now using this result which is given in the key idea, now r square is equal to dyx into dxy which further implies r square is equal to minus 8 by 5 into minus 8 by 5 which further implies r square is equal to 64 by 25 which implies r is equal to plus minus 8 by 5. Now dyx and dxy both are negative therefore r is also negative. Therefore r is equal to minus 8 by 5. As the value of r depends on the value of dyx and dxy so if both of them are negative, so R will be also negative and from this we will consider the negative value of R which is minus h by 5 which is less than minus 1. But the value of R lies from minus 1 to 1. Therefore, R cannot be minus 8 by 5. That is, we have assumed that equation 1 is the regression line of x on y and equation 2 is the regression line of y on x. So this assumption is wrong. Therefore, the equation 1 is the regression line of y on x. And equation 2 is the regression line of x on y. So we can write, therefore, equation 1 is the regression line of y on x. And equation 2 is the regression line of x on y. So again from then we get h y is equal to minus 5x plus 70 which implies y is equal to minus 5 by 8x plus 70 by 8 that is this is the regression line of y on x therefore the regression coefficient dyx will be equal to the coefficient of x in this equation. So this will be minus 5 by 8. And the equation 2 is the regression line of x and y. So from equation 2, we get 8x is equal to minus 5 times plus 50 which implies x is equal to minus 5 by 8y plus 50 by 8. 
Now the regression coefficient of x on y, that is bxy will be equal to coefficient of y in this equation, which is equal to minus 5 by 8. Now, r square is equal to byx into bxy. This implies r square is equal to minus 5 by 8 into minus 5 by 8. Which implies r square is equal to 25 by 64, which further gives r is equal to plus minus 5 by 8. Now as bx and bxy both are negative, these are negative, therefore r is also negative. So here we will consider the negative sign. So r is equal to minus 5 by 8. And here r is lying between minus 1 and 1. Hence the regression coefficient bxy is equal to minus 5 by 8. The regression coefficient pyx is equal to minus 5 by 8. And the correlation coefficient between x and y, that is, r is equal to minus 5 by 8. So this is the solution of the given question. And that's all for this session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.